<laughs> Good morning, you guys. So I was not expecting to start my part two this soon from my first vlog, but I wanted to go ahead and talk about some things that transpired that I wasn't expecting. Why are you staring at me? Because I'm watching a girl at work. She said she's watching a girl at work, okay? <laughs> this is black and blue, go ahead. What's the crime? An attempt to watch and not subscribe? Yep, that's a crime. Friends don't let friends watch and not subscribe. So, <laughs> come on, let's get into the video. Okay. So, you guys know we just launched. The my, my last vlog was basically the launch and the one design that I made available was from the new launch. And I don't know how, but I have a whole bin over in my corner, cubby area of stones. The, the whole thing is filled with all kinds of different colors and types of stones, sizes, everything. And last night I went to go start working on the orders and somehow, I thought I had a whole bunch of the stones I needed specifically for this drop. And I literally have like this much in one of these jars, I have this much left. And when I went to go look for the, the other stone, the other bags of stones, there aren't any. So now I'm sitting here like, so I got on with my manufacturer and I ordered, <laughs> I ordered the stones because Normal shops don't sell these stones. Not these ones, but the ones for the drop, they don't sell them. So you can't just go anywhere that people sell stones and expect for them to have these rounded ones. So, <clears throat> so I talked to my manufacturer and I said, I need them as soon as possible. And thank goodness they like working with me and I've worked with them for a long time now. So they said that they would be able to get it out to me in less than a week. So I'm like, Thank you. So, yeah, there's there are some people that ordered colors where the stones that I have more of are for those ones. So I'm able to fill some of the orders, just not all of them right now. So I was like, wow, I gotta tell everybody about this. This is one of the things that you'd probably keep to yourself as a business owner, like, um, Luckily my processing time is four to six weeks cause well, I'll be fine. But I'm like, let me, now I'm doing vlogs. So I'm like, I gotta tell you the good, the bad, the ugly. And so right, we're starting off this vlog with the ugly and it sucks, but I'm gonna take this time to actually, once I do the orders that I can finish, cause it's gonna take me about a day to do the orders that I can finish until I get the other stones. So I'm gonna go ahead and actually, I already have the designs, ideas, in the samples that I already made for my, it's my two year, my two year anniversary. Oh, my air conditioning was on, that was probably really loud. So my two year anniversary is coming up August 1st and the designs are unlike any design I've ever made in my shop. How it's done, is I, I'm so happy I thought of this idea. I haven't seen anybody else doing it. And like this idea just literally, I can't wait to show you. I cannot wait for you guys to see it. The way I do my anniversaries, like last year, I put out a mystery option on my website and then people are able to order it until I get to the cap. I cap it cause I can't make a billion pens. So I cap it off. And then I make the pens and then I do a video pack with me where I pack the orders from the anniversary. If you go on my channel, type in black and blue anniversary or something like that, that video will pop up and it'll show you guys what the one year anniversary design was. It was so freaking good. So many people asked me to order that pen afterwards and I was just like, it's not in my shop anymore. And then people started ordering it as a mystery or as a custom design and really you can order anything I can do in a custom so that was their way around it but I'm excited so I'm gonna go ahead and just knock out some of those pens because I know that I'm gonna need them come August 1st so I'll go ahead and put my time into something that's coming soon as well 
that I know a lot of people are going to want because I sold out pretty quick last year. So <sighs> I'm excited. I, it's like the bad, but I got, I, there's a silver lining. So the stones will get here soon. And until then, I guess here's vlog number two. <laughs> Okay, so time to walk some more. And it is such a pretty day outside. Oh, let me not show off people's addresses. It's too close to home. It is such a pretty day. And I've got some arm weights on. I have my body weight on, which I usually wear if I go walking. So let's try to get some sweat going. Okay, so I'm gonna take you guys through the process of prepping a pen. And let's go ahead and I'm actually gonna do this one. I'll show you guys what prepping a pen is like before I actually get started on them. First, I get rid of the clip. Piece of cake. I save those. <laughs> and then I'm gonna take my drill. I use a drill from Melody Susie. And then I'm gonna be shaving off this piece right here that we just broke off, as well as this part right here because it's raised and a little piece right here because that's also raised, if you can see that. Perfect. That plastic flies everywhere. I do actually have a dust collector and that's recommended <laughs> so that you don't have as much go everywhere. Then I'm going to take a buffing block and I will buff the entire pen. I'm going to take it apart and then buff this whole section so that it can hold on to the glue and the stones that much better. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. Then you're going to wipe it down with alcohol and you're good to go. Okay, so we are doing our second walk of the day, me and my sister, and my nose ring is crooked, ignore it, but <laughs> it is so beautiful. It just makes walking even better, but this is our second walk of the day. The lighting won't get any better than this throughout the rest of the video. <laughs> You know when you go in the fridge, you're not really hungry. You just want to come look in the fridge for no reason. I was about to say I'm hungry, but not let, let me not lie. I'm not hungry. I am just thinking about food. Who's with me? <laughs> I finished that other second pen. So these are both done. I want to do like a test where I like toss the pens, drop them off of a table, and all of that just to show you guys that they are durable. When the glue is dry, it's not moving. Stones are not falling off, none of that. For the tools as well as the 
pens, all of that. I'm looking for one to throw out right now. Just because it's a fun test to do, just be like, boop. I'm rambling right now, but it's because I haven't talked in a while. And when I'm talking to you guys, I'm, it's almost like I'm talking to somebody. That's why I can really get down with these vlogs. It's like my friends are here. Even, even when you guys aren't. Oh, also, this is still haunting me. You know what we're about to do, actually? Let me move with these pens. We're gonna do the unboxing. Hopefully this is good. Okay, so we have two packages. We have this one, and then we have this one, which this is gonna be what I wanna add in my shop. And seriously, you guys, when I say the suspense is killing me, I you don't understand. <laughs> you don't understand. I'm really good about waiting on opening packages, but this is, this package is kind of more so like inventory kind of for my shop. Something that I've been wanting that I get to play with and see now. And then also I get to add to my shop. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to start the unboxing where you guys can see me. And I'm going to switch to a top down tabletop view so that you can see what I'm going to do with the item that we unbox. First, let's do this one. I don't like seeing unboxings where you can't see the actual like... So you're gonna see less of my face, but I'm still here. But this is what the item looks like. I am so excited, I need scissors. I am so excited. Don't mind any of the stuff around me. It's fine, it's fine. <laughs> We're doing fine. Oh, let me tell you guys. So these are my friends. <laughs> they are on TikTok almost every night. Every night around I forgot what time zone they're in. They're two hours ahead of me though. So, or earlier than me. So at midnight, my time, 10 o'clock their time, that's when they're on, I'm central. They're on TikTok. They have multiple businesses. They do a lot. Lois does, she does, she did, she used to do jewelry. And I don't think she's doing jewelry anymore, but she does the sprinkles. I'll show you what that is. And then she does, the tumblers she makes tumblers they do oils they do all kinds of stuff so let's break into this this is so smart packaging it like this it's extra safe and you don't have to pay for like the priority shipping if you use your own packaging so excited oh this package smells so good oh I'm about to drop it so this is what the sprinkles look like you put them in a warmer and it makes the whole place smell amazing so this one is vanilla vibes and they said I was really gonna like this one so let's try it they smell so good <laughs> I get so excited about this and you get to watch them on their TikTok live and they package it in front of you Oh, that's good. That's good. Last time I unboxed their sprinkles, I wish you guys could have seen how I like would react to the smell because it's either like, or it's like, <laughs> there's so many different facial expressions that were happening in that first video and they were so good. I'm not a huge fan of vanilla. So I said, you guys decide what which ones to give me. So I purchased something you haven't seen yet. And then it came with three of these. And I was like, really, I get three of these too? So I am so excited because this smells better than I would have ever thought. I'm not a vanilla person, but this is good. Like blue, purple, periwinkle. They come, they have really pretty uh, warmers that you can purchase as well. Oh my gosh. Okay, so it's safe to say that, so there's Alan and there's Lois. They are married. They're the cutest little baby boy. You guys. So, look. how cute is this? Where's my, where's my real one? Maybe my daughter took it. But I have a Stanley Cup. Mine is a Tiffany Blue. Mine is Tiffany Blue like a greenish mint. And this is a keychain, and 
Alan does 3D printing and he made this. It's so lightweight and cute. Now this isn't just a cute little keychain. You're able to put your chapstick in here. Oh, it twists. Oh, it twists. Look at that. You can put your chapstick in here. It's like a holder and then you close it. And so when you want your chapstick, you just untwist it. That is so stinking cute. This is super cute. I'm definitely going to keep this probably on my desk. It just looks so cool. 3D printing stuff looks so fascinating and cool. That is beautiful. But wait, we're not done. We have Kiwi Melon. I love this. This is Kiwi Melon. It's green. I don't have any of these scents and I have a lot. I should bring out all of my scents. I got so many scents from them. It's wild. When I like something, I want a lot of it. This smells so good. Oh my gosh. This just took me back to like my childhood. I gotta close it to keep the scent in. This is amazing. This is my favorite one I've ever smelled from their entire company. I have a lot of them. And there's one that smells like really good black girl hair products. Love it. But this even beats that one. Kiwi Melon. It smells like... It makes me think of when we we're kids and we had like the lip smackers and we were going crazy with the lip smackers. That's what this smells like. Oh, it smells so good. I need my warmer. My warmer's still downstairs in my old office. I need to bring that up here like ASAP, like yesterday. Okay. Tropical Sun Shower is the last. Well, they actually gave me some samples too. I should do a giveaway in my vlog. Would that be crazy? A giveaway in the vlog? Tropical sun shower. Make sure you guys go follow them. If you're a TikTok person, like you go on TikTok and watch stuff on there, go follow them. I'll put all of their information down in the description box so you can find what I'm showing you. Ooh, okay. How do they pick three amazing scents? I did not even say. They asked if I liked fruity or flowery. I don't even think I answered. This smells almost like blueberry, tropical, like it's tropical, but there feels like there's a hint of blueberry in there. Tropical. I'm trying to grab notes from it, but I'm not good at that. So let me stop acting like I am. I just know this smells amazing. So it's kind of funny, but Kiwi Melon is my first number one favorite. And then... Tropical Sun Shower is my second favorite. This one has a hint of black girl hair products in the best way possible. So it's got a hint of that in here. So, wow. I'm gonna keep these, <laughs> I'm gonna keep these close to me. Goodness, that's good. That is really good. This is gonna be a long vlog. I'm probably gonna do a to be continued after this one too, but it's a good thing if you see to be continued at the end because that means I'm continuously recording. Strawberry Bliss, Manly Man. This smells like a guy. I already forgot the name of it is literally Manly Man. The second I smell this, I thought of a guy. My fiance is gonna love this one. Oh my gosh. He's, I always get my, my man, I always get him candles and we like the same candles. We love the same candles and he doesn't have a warmer, but I'm gonna have to get him a warmer so that he can do this instead of candles because we're both trying to steer away from candles that are not made out of soy, so. But these, this is good to burn. This is good to melt. No toxins are going in the air. This makes me think of something like potpourri. Childhood. Potpourri memories. <laughs> Potpourri, what is this one called? Confetti. I think that's where they mix different scents all in one. So it's kind of like a just throw in a mix. It makes me think of Potpourri, that last one. Those are really good. Alan, Lois, thank you guys. That was amazing. Now let's get into this. You guys are gonna freak. 
Should I do top down for this? I'm going to do top down view for this one. So uh, we are at a tabletop view. I did just get back from the event. Look at this keyboard. Oops. <laughs> I'm editing my video. And let me get off of that. Okay. This keyboard is amazing. I do need to respond to some comments and I love doing it more now with this really pretty keyboard. I love this. Okay. Now that I'm pushing crazy buttons, let's get into this. I actually just want to <laughs> show you guys my pretty binder. Eh. Oh, I got a new nose ring, but look, it's so pretty. I just want to show this as many times humanly possible because I love it so much. <laughs> okay. Let's get into this unboxing. <laughs> okay, so here it is. Max Creations, A and L for Alan and Lewis. Lois. I am so excited to see what's in here. This video is going to be a long one, I think. Hopefully y'all are okay with that. Seen this in real life so i'm just really pumped to see this i don't even i can't even oh my gosh look at them oh they look so good i cannot believe he literally makes these look at this you guys oh my gosh these are going to be pen holders i saw these i saw them oh cool is that a money sign Okay, this is way too cool. Oh my gosh, look. Oh wait, I thought this came off. Maybe not. <laughs> he put it together. Maybe he glued it for us. This is so nice. Okay, so we got white. This is so pretty. We've got the white. We've got light pink. We have this. This is a color shift. Look at that. That is wild. That is so cool looking. And then we have the light blue. And this isn't even a baby blue, I don't think. Maybe it is. I don't know. But I got this specifically for... Let me grab a bunch of pens that are not in my holders. Okay. I feel like I'm doing a video. <laughs> like, I just feel like I'm doing a video. Okay, so these are cute. They're like, they're so cute and like mini. Okay, let's grab some pens. Ooh, I like how much you can still see the pen while it's in here. This is what it's looking like. This is so pretty. So my shop name is Dripped by E. So when I saw this, I freaked out because it's got the really pretty drips. Oh, it's so pretty. Let's see how many pens I can get in here of my pens, my chunky pens. That's a good amount. You could probably fit one more in there, but why stress it? So we've got three six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen sixteen pens that's not bad at all that is a good amount this is so nice and these feel like they weigh like very little they're very lightweight this is so cool what if you could do like a dripping e my logo that would be so cool okay this is awesome it looks like there's money signs on the bottom this is this is what I want to add into my shop because I do have pen holders already in my shop and they're pretty, but they're not like this. <laughs> and I want to bling it and to see what it would look like if I bling just the drips. Oh my gosh, I don't know what I'm going to do. I think I'm going to do the white one. I'm going to do the white one. These are so freaking cute. Alan, you killed it. These look so beautiful. He did such a good job. We changed the size. He did, when I saw it, he had a, it was about five inches. Um, the span from the bottom is about five inches. And I was like, I need something a little bit smaller. And he nailed it. This is literally the perfect size. So he does, I think I already said it, but he 3D made these. 
I want like every color. I want one in every color. If you're watching this right now, I do have them up on my site right now. So you guys can go check them out. Some crystals. <laughs> So we can see, oh my gosh, this is going to be really pretty. I already know it. I'm going to have to speed through this part because we'll be here all night. Hopefully it'll still focus, but let's go ahead. This part right here is really skinny, so I'm going to have to use a smaller stone there. Okay. So since these are made by Alan in his shop, I am going to have them for pre-order because he would have to make them for me and then... I would bling them. Once they get to me, I would bling them and then send them out to you guys if you order from me if you want yours blinged. So I love this. All right, we are heading to the bank. We're going to the bank. And, and then Target and then Jewel, me and my sissy. Woo! Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> acting weird because I used probably the key versus my the phone. phone. Yeah. <laughs> it's freaking hot. <laughs> <sighs> it is so hot. I can't breathe. <laughs> it only says 70 degrees. That's that's not true. That's a lie. Yeah. It's about 95. <laughs> it feels like maybe 85. Maybe because it was in the shade. It might adjust a minute. Yeah, it, it, it will. And it, it was next to the AC unit. It does feel cool next to those. Does it? Yep. Feels kind of good whenever I have to walk uh, by the neighbors to do the keypad thing. <sighs> okay, let's go. So, let's try to remember what I need in case I forget. I can go back to this video, and it is going to be shaky because I don't have a I don't have a proper stand. But I need dishwashing detergent, fabric softener. Jewel for groceries. April can only eat soft stuff. She got braces, y'all. <laughs> and it was, oh my gosh, I have to tell, I can't wait to do my cash stuffing because I was stuffing the medical specifically for her braces coming up. And it was way cheaper than expected because she got them when she was younger. So they gave her a wild discount of thousands off. And they better because they said back then that she wasn't gonna need braces again. What if we were getting them for her at that age? They're like, she's not going to need them. She does. So, the price is good. I can't wait to tell you guys about that. Ooh, I'm so excited. You can probably hear the air conditioning, so I'm going to get out of here. But I also changed into black. I just, I just love black. And it's hot as ever out here, and I'm wearing a hoodie. Don't judge me. <laughs> this is all summer. <laughs> when I was a cop, it, I would wear my jacket all summer and I would be sweating bullets and people would look at me like I'm crazy partners included and I'm like don't judge me eventually they stopped asking about it but every summer I was in whew, I was in my jacket it was it felt like a security blanket for some reason like I had extra pockets to put my stuff in it was just I needed my pockets and my security okay I'm out of here I just got home. I'm about to go inside. My phone's acting weird, but I went to the bank, you guys, and I meant to tell you when I was at the bank, but then, oh well, I'm telling you now. They gave me this really cute bag to put the money inside of. They were like, this isn't gonna fit in normal envelope, and I'm like, and they put it inside here, and I'm like, it looks super, super cute. I'm gonna keep this bag. It is blue. And we got $2 bills, look. We got $2 bills. We got new tens. They keep giving me new tens. The fives look old, but I'm super excited. We got $2 bills though. And I didn't even have to order them. They already had them there. I'm so excited. We're gonna do a bank strap hunt video where we search for star notes. And I really can't wait to do it. So I'm probably gonna record that here in a few minutes, but that's gonna be a separate video. So make sure you're subscribed if you're not.
Okay, so this is the first row. It's looking really pretty. That took a little longer than I expected. <laughs> a little longer than I was expecting. And I'm thinking, I'm trying to debate on whether I would want a row up here. I think not. I think I'm going to leave that blank. But I really like this. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be gorgeous. It's basically gonna be a glitter, or not glitter. It's basically gonna be a bling drip with a black base. Oh my gosh, I'll show you guys when it's finished. I am gonna close off my vlog here though. I will continue a vlog once I start packing orders. I think I'll go ahead and do a vlog. If you guys are liking the vlog still, I'll, I'll do one where I'm packing orders from the launch. So let me know what you guys think. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. I did input some of the footage from the induction for the Rotary Club. And I hope you guys enjoyed that little bit of content. And if I didn't post it yet, you'll see it now. But <laughs> thank you guys so much. I appreciate you for being here. Uh, if you guys want to leave down below anything else you guys would like to see in my vlogs. I'm kind of just showing you here and there bits and pieces of what I'm doing with my small business and normal day, um, my normal life, but just a little snippet, but let me know what you guys think. I will go ahead and get out of here and I'm probably going to finish this because I'm dying to see what it looks like, but thank you guys for hanging out with me. I'll catch you in the next one. I'm out of here. Bye.